Hello, 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 everybody. This is Jordan Adler, and today is the 29th of May. The year is almost half over. Oh my gosh. 29th of May, 2018. And uh, tonight I want to talk about ideas. I really think that as it relates to money and business, ideas are probably your most valuable resources, your ability to generate and access ideas to actually create ideas that can inspire people. Um, and uh, yes, I am recording. So I wanna talk about good ideas and things that can help you to m advance your business, move your business forward, stay inspired, uh, and stay in action. First thing I wanna talk about is testimonials. Kathy Peterson today posted a fantastic testimonial in the official Send Out Cards Facebook group uh, I don't know if you saw it, but it was the CEO of Gettle Air Conditioning that she decided to send a card to. And the reason is because his commercials inspired her during a tough time in her life. Her mom was not doing well, and she would drive to go see her mom, and she'd hear these commercials that would keep coming on the radio for Gettle Air Conditioning, and they were inspiring commercials, and she just had a prompting to send the CEO of Gettle Air Conditioning, very famous air conditioning company, advertises all over the country, one of the largest air conditioning companies in the United States, I heard of them. And to get us, you know, he, she wasn't trying to get the CEO to call her back, that was not her goal. In fact, she had no, she didn't think she'd ever hear from him, but she knew that she could make his day a little bit better. So she sent him a card and guess what he called? She sent him brownies. He called and they had a nice chat and uh, he talked about how he was moved by her card. So already, it's a good story just there, but he messaged her a couple weeks later and decided that he wanted to use send out cards to recognize his employees. So check that out. Giving to give, not giving to get. You know, I could have started this by saying how to get CEOs to call you. Well, it is a way to get CEOs to call you, but uh, you know, she didn't send it with that intention. She sent it with the intention of just letting him know how his commercials inspired her. That was pretty cool. And you can find that one. And, and I think testimonials are powerful and you should collect testimonials, whether you keep them in a file on your computer or you actually print them out or create a list. I, I have a list of testimonials that I have that I've made copies of that I can leave with people. I think that's a great way of Again, moving your, advancing your business, moving it forward. Sometimes it's the testimonials that inspires people to want to take action. The second thing I want to talk about is leadership and timing. And I'm going to tell a story that you may have heard before, some of you. Uh, and then I'm going to talk about something that I haven't talked about recently. But I think that businesses rise and fall on leadership. When I look back on my career in network marketing, wherever there's leaders, there's growth. And a leader is not someone that comes along that where the company says you're a leader. It's not like that. It's when someone themselves declare that they're a leader and they actually create something in their area. Or it may not even be in their area. It might be something they create online where they are able to attract people and lead an organization by casting a vision and providing an anchor, providing um, you know, uh, a solid foundation that others can uh, have, have faith and comfort in. And uh, you, know, you, you really don't, you don't become a strong leader by casting a lot of doubt. Casting doubt on social media, casting doubt within the people that you c come in contact with on a daily basis, that's not positive leadership. That does not create positive growth. So whenever there's growth, there's leadership. That's what I've noticed. And also timing. And, and I want to talk about that. So Send Out Cards, I think, has been a company that has been before its time. It's like we've had really healthy growth over the past 14 years, not explosive growth, but healthy growth. And I think the reason we haven't had explosive growth, I believe, is because the timing was a little off. And here's what I think is going on right now. And see if this just makes sense to you. Look at the accelerated pace of marketing today between Facebook advertising, People are spending an enormous amount of money, billions of dollars on advertising and marketing. 
uh, billboards, radio, television, but even more so today, the internet marketing that's going on and Facebook ads and people are just pouring millions and millions and millions to the tune of billions of dollars into marketing. And we're getting this constant barrage of marketing to the point where it's an ear piercing pace. It's like a, it's an ear piercing level rather. It's hard to even sort through it. It's just overwhelming. And then there's send out cards and we send a card and it cuts right through all of it. Cuts right through all of it. So you take the timing of send out cards with everything going on in the marketplace along with a brand new platform that is as modern as Google. It's a, it's a modern platform and then our new plans that have never been done before. And I don't know about you, but my experience in the past few days, the past month, it's like a feeding frenzy right now. I've never seen anything like it. I just talked to someone today, a, a distributor in my organization. I'm, not, I'm waiting till he actually achieves this, but it looks like he's going to sign up one referral partner on a Premier or Enterprise every day for 10 days in a row. And he told me today that he thinks he can do that, and he's on track already. He's been doing it for, I think, three days now, and he's got three for three. He's actually signed up a couple in one day. But I'm seeing this all over the company. The, the level, the, the number of people signing up in these programs are like I've never seen before ever in our history. And it's just the beginning. We're just getting started. So when you take leadership and timing and put that together, that's when everything explodes. That's what I'm seeing right now. It's kind of like the perfect storm. And so, you know, the timing conversation is a conversation you can have with potential referral partners. Talk about why is this a great time? Why is it a great time to be part of the growth of this company? Number three, appreciation pal. Um, this again, it's a, it's a tool. $12.95 a month, it's like, that's like 30 cents a day, you guys. It's like, it's like a fraction. It's like one-tenth of a cup of coffee a day at Starbucks. And you have, the, you have the power of a platform that will do the selling for you. Appreciation, pal. I use it every day. Now, even just the blog, even just the blog that's put together for you with all the articles, there's a weekly blog. You can send it out to everybody in your appreciation, pal. So when you meet people, you put in their name and their email address and their phone number if you want to. And then once a week, you send out the newsletter. And the newsletter is different each week. And Send out cards puts that newsletter together and you can send it out. And if they click through it, your phone number's on there, your, your website's on there. If they click through, that's coded to you. I'm signing up distributors and, and, and um, referral partners and customers from that every week now. So that's a, that's a really good thing. And to sign up for it, if you don't know how to get there, I'm not trying to convince you to do it. I think you should, but it's appreciationpalsystem.com appreciationpalsystem.com. Think about this. What if you did, what if, what if you just went to Mark, forget, even forget about the blog for a minute that's in there. That get, you can send that out weekly, which I recommend you do, but forget about that for a minute. If you click on marketing pages in your appreciation pal, there's four links and each link is attached to a, a page. One of the pages is the opportunity. One of the pages is relationship marketing weekly. And there's a couple more. If you just, I use the relationship marketing weekly. If you cut and paste that link into a text message or into a private message on Facebook, just cut and paste it. Um, they then have access to your appreciation pal through that, but they get to see all the videos. And then again, if they upgrade or if they decide to try something, it's going under you because it's coded to you. It's got your embedded code in the link. You just copy it from your appreciation pal and paste it in. It's under marketing pages, really easy to find. In fact, if you sign up for Appreciation Pal and just click on marketing pages on the upper left, you'll see it right there. You can't miss it. It's right there. You just copy the link and paste it. You'll know exactly what to do. If you do one or three of those a day, one to three of those a day, that's 30 to 90 a month to people that you've shown send out cards to and people that you haven't shown send out cards to, just asking people to check it out and tell you what you think. Come here. I want to show you something. Just check it out that is going to have a positive impact on your business. It can't not. If you just did that every day consistently, even when you're feeling a little depressed, like right now, some of you are. I know some of you are depressed right now. I know you're sad. Some of you cried hard. Some of you cried a little. I got a little choked up when I heard for the first time, you know, but everything's going to be fine. So the, the fourth thing, I think we're on the fourth thing. 
be on at least the $97 a month plan and send at least uh, three included cards per day. And I know some of you don't like the word free, so I'll say included. I, I like the word free. You pay 97 bucks a month for the system and your cards are free with the stamps. Unlimited individual cards, unlimited, included. Do three a day. Look on Facebook. Every day in the morning, I scroll through my news feed and I look for pictures of things that are going on in people's lives that I think would, um, would uh, be something that they would like to be appreciated for. And I click on it, save it on my phone, and then I put it on the front of a card. And if I don't have their address, I message them. And if I do, I just send them that card. And I do that every single day to the tune of today, I probably sent uh, 10 cards today, 10. And I can do that for free, included, right, with my $97. Actually, I'm paying 147 because I want the group sends as well. So I had a guy this week, I'm gonna call him out, I'm not gonna say his name, I don't even know if he's on tonight, but he was upset, not upset, he was just disappointed because uh, his group wasn't growing. Now you ready for this? He hasn't worked the business in five years. Five years he hasn't been working the business. He gets a check every month for five years. Hasn't worked the business. And he was complaining to me on the phone that his group wasn't growing. And I asked him how many cards is he sending out every day and he said he had a thousand points in his account. A thousand points sitting there doing nothing, stagnating growing mold, collecting dust. And he's wondering why his group's not growing and he's wondering why he's not growing in the business. He's been, he hasn't worked the business in five years. He has a thousand points in his account. He's not sending very many cards, obviously, because you can't have a thousand points in your account if you're sending cards consistently. Points are going away. Use your points, get them out, send them out in the form of gifts and then get on the 97 or the 147 program and start sending three cards a day. Watch what happens if you just get into action and stop thinking about it and stop planning. Just start doing every day. A lot of you are, I know I'm preaching to the choir, but a lot of you aren't. Number four, for those of you that have booked convention in the past, you know what I'm talking about, but the day you book convention, everything changes. Convention starts the day you book it. The day you actually buy your ticket and plan on going, the convention starts that day. And it runs all the way up to convention day, all the way up to the actual event. Because what it, what it represents is a level of commitment, a level of, of I'm gonna do this. I'm committed to making this happen and that's why I'm buying my ticket to convention. Everything changes once you commit. I'm not married, but I know a lot of you are, but wouldn't you agree that the day that you got engaged, everything changed? Long before the wedding. The wedding was just an event, but from the time that you got engaged to the time of the wedding, everything changed about your relationship because you committed. So what if you committed to convention? Now, not just saying you're going to go, but actually buying your ticket. And then you'll notice that convention will start you'll get connected at, with send out cards at a level that you never have been before. Number, let's see, I don't even know if we're on four or five. Let's see, that's one, two, three, four, five. Number, that's number five. Number six, I got a couple more for you. Number six, stop making decisions that broke people make. Just ask yourself, what do broke people do? They hoard, they wait, they doubt, they complain constantly. They don't invest in themselves. They're impatient. They quit when things get tough. So don't stop making decisions that broke people make and start making decisions that people that are growing. I'm not even going to say rich people. I'm just going to say people that are growing, people that are making progress. That's number six. Yes, number seven. Sign everyone up that says not now. Now, what do I mean by that? What if you were to sign every single person up that says not now? What do I mean by that? Sign them up on a free account. Doesn't cost them anything to be on a free account. That way they can send cards when they need to send cards. So 
demo the app, show them the plans, and if they're not ready to do one, put them on a free, free account so they, they can at least send cards out. What if you did that once or one to three times a day? One to three times a day and get an action. Number seven, number seven, refresh your list. Now what I'm doing, it's like, I feel like I'm in the business starting over all, like all over again because you know, when I started, I had thousands of people, lots of business cards and people I'd met that I was so excited about showing send out cards to. And over the years, I showed it. Over 14 years, I've shown it to just about everybody, except I meet new people. And so I'm always bringing new people to, to show it to. But all of a sudden, I, now I have to show it to everybody all over again because it's a whole new company. And what I'm finding is a lot of people are signing up that were not interested in the old send out cards that are interested in the new send out cards. Because of our interface, they love it. It's so slick and they love it when they get on it. And the programs, they see them. Like I signed up this guy that he signed up years ago, uh, didn't really do much with it. But he, um, you know, when he saw the new programs, he was like, I, I, he says, I have so many people I can sign up on this. And he, so he got started again. And I went to high school with the guy, lives in Chicago. So I really believe that this growth spurt will be significantly bigger than our first wave. It's coming and it's coming fast. So you don't want to sit on your hands right now. You do not want to do that. Not unless you want that wave to pass you. Number seven, number seven, number eight rather, number eight. I'm not good at counting if you haven't figured that out. Start a group, start a, start a private secret Facebook group and invite your friends into it and let them know that you, wanna, you want to um, uh, reveal something in the group that, that you think they might be interested in and ask them if they'd be interested in joining the group. Um, and uh, I'll, be, I'll be going through more specifics on how to do this, but it's really simple. You just go on Facebook, you set up a group, you make it a secret group, and then you invite friends into it. Name the group something that is, doesn't say send out cards. It can say marketing. It can say appreciation. It can say relationship. Uh, we have uh, one guy that called his group 365 thank yous, 365 thank yous. But come up with a group name, invite people into the group, and then you can drip on them with inspiring stories, memes, um, testimonials, things like that. I think it's a really powerful concept. And then also you can go live in the group and talk about stuff. You can hold up the plans and say, look what I got. Look at this. Let's talk about these plans in a Facebook Live in your private group with 100 of your friends. It's really a powerful way of doing it. And then number nine, um, this is one of my favorites right now. Check this out. Some of you have seen this. These were at convention. These are just some of the professions that we have campaign sets put together for. I don't know if that's backwards for you or not, but there's pet care, beauty, insurance, finance. Sometimes by showing these to people, either on a Zoom like this, you can buy this, by the way, in the, in, under your subscriptions, in your campaign store, you can buy these. And I think it's 100 bucks for the whole set, but each one of these is a five to 10 card, card campaign set that people can purchase. And we get commissions when somebody buys those. Um, I bought one. I bought the network marketing one. It's a, it's a five touch campaign that I've already used it a bunch of times. Somebody comes in, I customized them a little bit. I hit send, they get the first card. And then a few months later, they get the second and the third all the way through the course of the year. And we have one for all these. And I heard we're getting ready to add a whole bunch more. In fact, check this out. They're working on one set, a five card campaign set for BNI new members. So every BNI chapter that wants each new member to receive five cards over the course of the year talking about different aspects of the growth in BNI and welcoming, welcoming them to the chapter and all those kinds of things that will be pre-designed pre for them. And they just need to buy the campaign set. And then it costs about somewhere in the range of $10 a year for the cards and the stamps for the entire campaign per member. So they have to budget that. So each member gets five cards over the course of the year, which is going to cost the chapter about 10 bucks per member. And that's for the cards and the stamps. But again, this is a really good tool for just showing potential referral partners and saying, you know, who do you know that are in these professions? These are campaign card sets that are already put together for you. So there's nine ideas for you, nine ideas. 
And um, I hope that uh, you got some ideas from what we went over tonight. I want to thank you for being on. I'm going to look. Hang on. Don't leave me yet. Don't leave me yet. Stick, stick with me here for a minute. I just want to look at some of the comments. We got a couple more minutes anyway. So I want to see if there's any questions. Okay, good, good, good. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Kathy Powell, good to see you. Joe Jackson, how are you? Great, great, great. Well, hey, hi, Judy. How's it going? Oh, I actually gave you 10. So I gave you 10 ideas. You get one bonus idea. Nine ideas, one bonus idea, 10. So anyway, you guys have a great, uh, great week. And um, thanks for being on with me tonight. And we got a lot of work to do. And we're going to have a lot of fun together building this company and growing this company. So, and your check, growing your check and this company. So love you guys. And we'll talk soon. Take care. Bye-bye.